And so for you to manifest, you have to build up, build up in prayer. Because there is a place you pray to where there are coals of fire. That's where your tongue will be touched. And if your tongue is taught, it will be taught. When you come back, you can become a prophet. When you pray, your goal is not time. A lot of spiritual brethren have missed it. You see them in the place of prayer with so much vigor. But their goal is to beat 5 hours. Their goal is to beat 10 hours. But the Holy Ghost is far from them. So they pray for 10 hours, but they don't hear a whisper from the Holy Spirit. There are brethren that fast for 21 days. They are going time. At the end of that activity, they don't hear anything from the Holy Ghost. The goal is the person, the Spirit. Everything you will ever have in God is already encapsulated in the Holy Spirit. Your apprehension of the Spirit of God is your apprehension of your health. Apprehension of your riches. It's your apprehension of vitality. You must therefore make every demand upon yourself to apprehend the person of the Holy Spirit. There are people who are given to all kinds of activity now. Activity does not change anybody. Activity does not transform anybody. It is the supply of the spirit that makes the difference. I'm a traveling minister. I move around the country virtually every week. I can set this place on fire in 15 minutes. But I've come to discover that most times people don't even hear what we say. So in recent time, I take time to emphasize some of these basics. When you go to the place of prayer, what do you focus on? Consciously focus on the Holy Spirit. Now, the Spirit of God is being released already upon this mountain. And you have been there here for more than 24 hours. What has God told you as an individual? What has God whispered to your heart since you came? Activities are going on. Power of God is moving. A lot of things are happening. What have you heard from God? What have you apprehended already? Who told you you'll get it tomorrow? Come and be carried in the bandwagon and think you are doing something. The moment you are separated, you discover you are empty. The possession that is given upon the mount is the spirit. And everyone that comes to the mountain of the Lord must lay hold on the spirit. And so for you to manifest, you have to build up, build up in prayer. Because there is a place you pray to where there are coals of fire. That's where your tongue will be touched. And if your tongue is taught, it will be purged. When you come back, you can become a prophet. <laughs>